Thank y'all so much for coming out, and thanks to all of y'all who are tuning in from all over the place. We are the Jeremy Langthorne Quartet. My name is Jeremy Langthorne. Uh, so happy to be back down here from the Dallas area. It's always a treat playing at this venue. Um, it's also, I don't know if any of y'all watch, y'all probably all watch a lot of the live streams too. The quality that comes out on the other side of that is just second to none, so... Yeah, it's always a great time being out here. Uh, I'm going to introduce these guys real quick. Uh, Fabio Agostinas on drums. <laughs> Damian Garcia on piano. And Billy Satterwhite holding it back down there on bass. Uh, that tune we just played was uh, by a saxophonist named Hank Mobley called This I Dig of You. It's off of his album called Soul Station, which is one of the greatest albums ever recorded. Or at least I think so. I don't know. <laughs> uh, this next one is a tune that I actually wrote. Uh, how the hell about that? Uh, and uh, I actually played this one of the, actually the very first time I did one of these. It wasn't even when we, Monks was in this room. It was in when they're in the other shop area, room, whatever you want to call it, down the street, uh, back during the height of the pandemic, I guess. Uh, but yeah, this is the tune I wrote actually a few years ago um, called Based Off the Abstract Truth. And what inspired me to write this was uh, kind of an album uh, by a saxophonist named Oliver Nelson, uh, just the whole vibe and the whole, the, a lot of the songs in there are just really kind of high energy and all that stuff. And when I wrote this, I kind of wanted to capture some of that. Um, so this is called Based Off the Abstract Truth. Thank you. 
Yeah, just like that. Also, for those of y'all who are uh, uh, live streaming at home, we do also have uh, PayPal and Venmo. That's all at Monk's Jazz. So if y'all are feeling so financially generous, we, uh, we all appreciate your tips and all that good stuff. Uh, yeah, and also this, this whole operation is completely DIY. So all of you who have showed up or all of you who feel so generous enough to tip the band, all that money goes to us, and all that money also goes to this venue to make sure this place keeps keeps functioning and supporting incredible live music. Uh, yeah, so this next one we're gonna do is a uh, is a standard called "Out of Nowhere," uh, but it's a really, really super weird arrangement of it uh, by a saxophonist uh, named Jerry Berganzi. Um, and he always likes taking standards and really completely flipping them on their head or doing all sorts of weird harmonic stuff to them. And this is one of those. This is one of those. Uh, <laughs> so uh, this is Out of Nowhere, the weird Berganzi version of it. Thank you. 
Yeah, thank y'all so much. Colin, you want to say a few words? Sure. All right, I'm going to get up, get up the, the owner slash curator slash piano, piano extraordinaire slash uh, sandwich enthusiast slash self-proclaimed upright bass maximalist, Colin Shook, everybody. Best intro ever. Thank you, Jeremy. Give it up for Jeremy Langthorne. Uh, just want to thank you all for coming out tonight and everybody for tuning in online. If this is your first time here at Monks or watching the stream, we've been doing this ever since the pandemic started. Uh, we started Monks as a pop-up listening room in 2016 at a few different venues on the east side doing, you know, two or three shows a month. But I uh, did that for about four and a half years, and when the pandemic hit, uh, we took about two months off and started streaming, found a studio across the street over here on 6th Street, did about 150 shows over there, maybe 100 shows, and we moved in here pretty much a year ago, March 18th, makes one year uh, in the studio. We've got over 350 concerts just like this on the live stream on, uh, on YouTube and Facebook and all that, and we've been able to feature so much amazing local jazz and you know, musicians from around the state, including Dallas, uh, t for tonight. We're featuring Jeremy. He lives up there in the DFW area. But uh, we're really happy to be able to feature so much different music. If you want to see some more, please go to the Monks Jazz website. Uh, our next upcoming show will be Sunday night. There's a fantastic uh, upright bassist. His name is Derek Thigpen, and he'll be, he'll be doing his uh, master's recital here with a big group. He's attending uh, Texas State in San Marcos, and so it's going to be a great time, and we have a bunch of shows coming up in April, so please stay tuned for that. If you're watching online, please like the page, all that stuff. If you're on Facebook, come over to YouTube. The audio and video quality is so much better. Um, we're nine people away from hitting 2,500 subscribers there. We're really growing this big channel here and trying to feature as much jazz as possible, but... Most importantly, if you're watching online, we do have a very limited audience here in the studio, so if you can feel so generous, if you like what's going on, please go to that Venmo, PayPal, support this fantastic band. Thank you, guys. Yeah, thank you, Colin. Honestly, the best part about this gig is introducing and trolling Colin at the same time. Let's be real. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, playing music is fun, too. Uh, I guess I should throw that in there. Um, so this next one we're going to do, speaking of music, uh, is uh, another great standard called On Green Dolphin Street.
Oh, yeah, thank y'all so much. Uh, this next one we're going to do is uh, another one I wrote, and I actually finished writing this before I drove down today, as I tend to do with 90% of all the all, of all the few tunes I do, usually wind up always getting finished within hours before they're actually played for the first time. I don't know, maybe that's like procrastination, maybe that's just like... Uh, when the whenever it's like when when you're writing something you, you're always thinking oh man this sucks this sucks or this is lame or whatever and i guess one once you're under crunch time that sort of you know that sort of voice in your head kind of goes away and you just you know whatever comes out is whatever comes out and usually it winds up being okay for the most part um <laughs> no i think this one actually turned out really cool um and i'm really excited for it uh this one is Sort of another tribute to Joe Henderson, uh, one of my favorite saxophone players. And the, the, it's called Joe Hen, Joe Henderson for short. Um, and basically what it is, is on a lot of these kind of gigs, I always pick the same few Joe Henderson tunes. And so I was like, well, fuck it. I might as well write a tune that mashes them all together. And uh, so I did. And this is what came out. This is called Joe Hen.
Yeah. I just finished writing that tune today. I'm sure my mom, if my mom were in the room after hearing that F-bomb, she'd pop me harder than Will Smith did Chris Rock. But that's neither here nor there. I had to fit a, I had to fit a Will Smith joke in there. Uh, we're going to play a ballad. Next, we got a couple more tunes left. Uh, first off, once again, shout out to Colin Shook for having us and doing all the things that he does. I, I introduced him as five different things, but literally he does just about everything. Uh, there are more things that he probably does that he doesn't, than he doesn't do, if that even makes sense. Words are hard sometimes. Uh, but yes, uh, shout out to him and for running all of this and having us. Uh, also, shout out to this band. I mean, it's really, yeah. It's, it's, it is a luxury to, to know people who you can just finish writing up a tune where you don't even know how it's really going to sound, and they, they play their asses off on it. So shout out to them. Uh, we're going to slow things down. Uh, oh, one more thing. Uh, like I said, words are hard. Uh, <laughs> uh, we, like we said earlier, we do have Venmo. We do have PayPal. That's Venmo at Monk's Jazz. PayPal something something Monk's Jazz. Uh, if you are feeling so financially inclined, uh, please give us your money. That's me asking nicely. <laughs> but seriously, no, um, all, all your tips go to us and help us and help this venue stay afloat uh, and keep and help it keep producing the quality music and especially the quality live streams too um, for those of y'all watching at home so your your financial contributions are greatly appreciated uh, yeah we're gonna keep playing some more music <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, thank y'all so much. Very nice. Damien Garcia on piano. Billy Satterwhite on bass. Fabio Agostinis on drums. My name is Jeremy Langthorne. We got time for uh, one more song. Uh, this next one is actually going to be, uh, or this last one, I should say. Uh, is actually going to be uh, by a piano player slash composer named Cedar Walton, who is right from Dallas, Texas, actually. I was almost going almost to say right here from Dallas, Texas. But as it turns out, we are in Austin, so that wouldn't, that wouldn't go over too well. Uh, but yeah, this one is called Bolivia. Once again, shout out to Colin Shook for doing this all the time. Uh, and give it up for Jesse running sound and running live stream and everything. Yeah, shout out to him for uh, making all this sound good, too. Uh, well, if no one else has got anything to say, then uh, this is Bolivia.
Fabio Agostinus on drums, Billy Satterwhite on bass, Damian Garcia on piano, Jesse behind sound, Colin doing pretty much everything. My name is Jeremy Langthorne. Y'all have a great night.